Hello and welcome to another video. I'm going to be returning the Ninjutsu Sora, and it's not for a QC issue externally, like side flex or button wobble or button creaking or anything like that. It is because of one major issue that I've already spoke about a lot of times, uh, that I've already spoke about a lot of times in the past. That is the stuttering cursor issue, where it will randomly start jittering back and forth for like a good second, making me unable to move my mouse and making it impossible for me to move for a good second. And then it'll just snap right back like like nothing happened. And then we'll just continue to play normally until it'll randomly start stuttering again for some reason. Apparently some other, some people said it was because they cheaped out on the MCU, which is a pretty good argument. But other people haven't had this issue, so I don't know. I, I think I just got a defective copy or something, because this should definitely not be happening. I updated my firmware, I updated my drivers, I don't think it's my PC that's the problem, because all of my other wireless peripherals that I've had in the past have not had this problem at all. So I'm pretty sure it's a problem with an M with the MCU on my copy, the chip inside of the mouse that gives the wireless transmissions to the dongle. And... It doesn't matter where I place the dongle, it will still stutter somewhat, and especially in CSGO. It's not a, like very noticeable in Apex Legends, although it is still noticeable, but it's definitely nowhere near as noticeable as like CSGO, because for some reason, this mouse hates CSGO, and every time I play, there's always stuttering. Like, basically, no matter what, there's always stuttering. Maybe sometimes I won't get stuttering in, like, one game or two games here and there. But for most of the time, it is going to stutter at least once. And it is very noticeable. And it sucks. And it is very annoying, which is the reason why I'm returning the mouse. Because it's... And it's a bummer because I'm not returning it for, like, a QC issue or, like, button issue like I normally do. I actually have an excuse this time for where this shouldn't be happening. It actually affects my performance you know the other times i return a mouse i don't return it because something affects my performance all right it's just stuff that gets on my nerves that annoys me but this is on another level it annoys me sure but it also is a performance hinderer and really fucking sucks and just hinders my performance and sucks because it's extremely lightweight and there's no other problems with the mouse at all besides this one huge issue which is the reason, again, why I'm returning the mouse. And it sucks. But, yeah, that's basically it. Uh, I already contacted the just of support, and I asked if I can return it, and they said I could, and I still have yet to get a address from them. But I'll probably get that tomorrow. Uh, but, yeah, that's basically it. It's a bummer, and I hate that I had this issue. Because I tried so many fixes and none of them did anything. I tried changing liftoff distance, debounce time, even though that wouldn't do anything. And updating firmware, updating drivers didn't do anything. But yeah, that's basically it. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.